Hi everyone! Welcome back to LMT YouTube channel. Inside Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's rumored move to Canada, will they risk losing their royal titles? Could Prince Harry and Meghan Markle be planning a move to Canada after an extended break there from their royal duties? According to a new report, the Sussexes are in talks with the royal family to discuss their future, with some speculation that they could be based in Canada for a portion of the year. Will Prince Harry and Meghan Markle be moving their office to Canada? They've only just returned from their time away, and already a rumor mill is in action. According to a December 7 report from Dan Wooten, LMT Channel has learned they will start discussing their plans with senior royals, expected to include the Queen and Prince Charles in the coming days. The report notes that they've been in preliminary talks, telling friends that they would like to spend the next two months in Canada after they have been sidelined by the monarchy. A friend shared with LMT Channel, it is true that Harry and Meghan will spend a fair amount of time in Canada over the next couple of months and possibly going forward too. Right now they are starting talks with their family about their plans for the future. Those conversations are at a very early stage. The insider continued, there is a very careful and serious process to go through, which they are going to respect. But it is clear they are on a different and unique path, and they are very much thinking about what the future looks like for them. Will Prince Harry and Markle lose their royal titles? If the rumors about the couple returning to Canada in 2020 are true, there is the matter of their royal titles and whether they'd be turning their backs on their duties. The Sussex's friend told LMT Channel that their future could include being based in Canada or the possibility of walking away from their HRH titles, although hopefully it will not come to that. When looking at how challenging it was for them in 2019, their friend believes it's certainly a possibility that they'll want to step out of the spotlight a bit. The source shared, it's been a very tough year, they're newlyweds and they have a young baby, so they're looking at what their life looks like in the future. Everything is on the table. Canada is a likely option because they have friends there, and Megan feels comfortable and at home there because she lived there for seven years before meeting Harry, the insider shared. Further, their friend notes, they very much enjoyed their time over Christmas and New Year, where they weren't pictured once and were left alone. What's next for Prince Harry and Markle? Though their break is now over, the couple is said to be at work planning the launch of the Sussex Royal Foundation. LMT Channel further reports that if the couple makes this move, there is concern that they may exile themselves from the royal family, with a friend sharing that it has been made very clear by the institution that the Sussexes are not central to the future plan. Their specific plans remain to be seen, but LMT Channel contacted the palace and it dismissed the speculation and shared they would not comment about the rumors of a move to Canada. They spent the year just making odd missteps, which brought a lot of this stuff on themselves. And we reached a point towards the end where everyone was glad, they were glad to get away for six weeks. I think everyone was glad they all calmed down. What advice would you give them for this year? They've come back refreshed, they look a bit happier than they left. What advice would you, maybe you've given this advice to them about how to, good friends, how to change you? the narrative and the mood about them with the media? It's a really, it's a good question and it's a really big question in a way because I think their relationship with the media had got so bad that it was almost impossible to have that conversation anymore. Um, they have a particular view and I'm not saying it's right or wrong, I, that's just their view that they feel um, that the media is dishonest and all the other stuff you know. 
and they kind of want to take a stand against it. And I don't know whether six weeks away has changed that in any way. I think the truth is there's a lot, I think, going on. There's a lot going on within the royal family. And I don't know, and I'm not sure they know, what their future is going to be and what their position is. The Sun through. Today front page says they think you're spending a lot more time in Canada where they've just been, where, of course, Meghan spent seven years of her life filming suits, and that they are even contemplating potentially dropping the HRH title, perhaps recognising that with that comes the duty to do a lot of stuff that they really don't want to do. I don't know the answer. I mean, it's no big secret in their friends that they've been considering, you know, that they've been considering their options in the future. But they're very, uh, they keep exactly, I mean, I don't ask mm. what their plans are and um, they keep that pretty close to their chest and understandably so. I, I don't think it's a done deal. That would be my impression. I think there's a lot of talking to be done about, you know, they, there's a million possibilities. Don't stop.